Okay, so in this video, we'll be solving another problem all about um, population growth. Okay, so we are still on our topic on the applications of first order differential equation. Okay, so we have here the rate of population growth of a country is proportional to the number of inhabitants. No? If a population of a country now is 40 million and 50 million in 10 years time, what will be its population 20 years from now? So this problem is different from the previous problem no? that we have solved no? in our previous video because on this type of problem, we are now looking on, we're not, we are now trying to solve the number of population or the, or the, pop, the actual number of that population given the number of years past. No? Um, on the previous um, videos, on the previous problems that we have solved, we are uh, focusing no, on how many years or what is the time duration for a certain population to grow on a certain number. Okay, so now we will solve this one no, without much farther farther ado. No, okay, so we have our solution. Okay, so we have here um, ln p is equal to kt plus lnc no? so for those of you who are new to this um, channel and also the first time to view uh, our um, series on the applications of first order uh, differential equations so the link for the discussion of this um, of this or the derivation of this formula is on the on the card no, above this video no, which will appear no, um, um, which will appear on the upper uh, part of our video okay so let's have here the initial conditions first no? so at t is equal to zero so that is the initial um, condition no? so our initial population is equal to 40 million no? Okay, so to make our solution short, so we just have that one as 40m. So m stands for million. Okay, so let's substitute that one to our formula. So lnp kt plus lnc. No? So we have here ln 40m is equal to k. Our time is 0 plus lnc. No? So this will be 0. So we will now have ln. 40m or 40 million is equal to our lnc okay now the second one the second condition no so at t is equal to 10 years no so the, po the population will now grow to 50 million no 50m okay so same formula ln or self equation lnp kt plus lnc so our l our p is 50 million so just substitute that one okay. so 50 m is equal to k our t is 10 years plus lnc our lnc is equal to ln 40 m so ln 40 m so transpose our ln 40 m to this side of the equation so we have ln 50 m so this is positive no so this will be negative so ln 40m is equal to 10k. No? Then using the property of logarithm, so we'll have ln 50m over 40m is equal to 10k. So this will be cancelled out. So we will have ln 50 over 40 is equal to 10k. No? So we say we simplify this one. So we have ln. So that would be five over four. No? So uh, the common um, divisor here would be ten. No? So ten k. So solving for k. So divide both sides by ten. No? Okay. So we'll have our k is equal to ln 5 over 4 divided by 10 okay so now at the next condition in which now we will be solving the population no? so 
at t is equal to 20 years no? so we will be looking for our t no? so it's the same equation ln t kt plus ln c no? then our p is the unknown so ln t is equals to k so our k so this is our k here so that is ln 5 over 4 over 10 then our t is 20 years plus lnc which is our lnc is equal to 40 m no? 40 m okay then simplifying this one further so we have lnp is equal to this will be cancelled out of 2 so 1 so we have 2 ln 5 over 4 plus ln 40 m no? so raise the this one so to make this one as a power of an exponential function so e ln p is equal to e so we will use the property of logarithm for this one so that will be ln 5 over 4 it's just like like this one legibly 4 squared plus ln 40 m okay so now let's just have this one simplified no? so we have p is equal to will be 5 over 4 squared so that will be times 40 m okay so this this will be times because as we all know if that is an exponential function the two exponents are are multiplied no because they are uh, they are the actual they are the they have the same base no so they are the same base so if we're going to combine those exponent having the same base we will um, add the exponents no or maybe i'll just write here the next step for this one no so let's have the shortcut let's have this one no? okay so what we really have in here is we have here e l n p is equal to e l n 5 over 4 squared times e l n 40 no so this is l n 40 m no so that we so now we will have ln p is equal to 5 over 4 no that, that is not ln p but only p Sorry for that one so p is equal to 5 over 4 squared times 40 m okay so we can now have our p okay so we have 5 over 4 squared times so 40 so that is 40 million 40 m is per day so 40 million okay so we have 1 2 3 so usually i don't write that so many zeros because million so that is mega that is 4 times 10 to the power of 6 no? okay so we have this is uh, so 6.25 million no? 62.5 million so we have 62.5 million no? or um, 6 62 million 500 thousand so this now is our answer for this problem okay so i hope you understand something in this video and as always enjoy learning